Okay, so now I'm going to talk about the um, the reason why women wear the scarf in Islam. Now, of course, you might notice that there are nuns who wear who are covered up, uh, just like Muslims are, and a lot of times Muslims get mistaken for nuns, which is kind of funny. But um. So what? So the main reason why we wear a scarf on our head and we dress modestly is because God said to. That's the first thing. The second thing is, we consider Mary, the mother of Jesus, the most pious of all women, and we want to follow in her example because she was the most pure of all women. That's another thing. The third reason is, and this is in the Quran as well, as God said, uh, you know, um, cover yourself to make it known that you are believing women. So let's say I'm at the side of the road, my car breaks down for some reason, or I have a flat tire. If somebody sees me wearing a scarf, any Muslim guy is going to go out of his way to come and to help me. Because he's going to know, okay, well this this woman she needs help she's a Muslim woman and she needs help so that's another reason and it's also a good tool for telling people about Islam I mean if I wasn't wearing a scarf on my head no one would know I'm Muslim for one thing and another thing is I wouldn't be able to tell people that I'm Muslim and these are the right things about Islam and we believe this and that you know so that's why. And um, it's also for our protection. So that um, people, they don't treat us, you know, like, like, um, like, uh, like uh, sexual objects and that we are respected as human beings, not animals or something, you know? I mean, if you look at these shows like American Idol or, you know, Oh, You Think You Can Dance, do you think that these women are really respected? No. Do you think these men respect these women? No. So, that's why we do that. And so, um, you know, there's so many... I mean, the Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him, he always stood up for the rights of women. He was the most kind man. And you, you know, you really should read about him. And don't go to these hate sites because they're not going to put honest and, um, uh, you know, true material. If you want to learn about Islam, you go to the Quran or you ask a Muslim. You don't ask a Christian or a Jew because obviously they don't want you to know, you know. So um, that's just what I have to say about that. And. You know, I'm so happy to be a Muslim woman, and I, m my husband treats me very, very well. Seriously. And if you look at the crime rates in the Muslim countries compared to the West right now, you'll see there's not as many rapes against women, there's not as many murders against women. I mean, it's not just women. The crime rates in general, you will see that it's a lot less in the Muslim countries. Thank you very much. Bye-bye.